Hi guys, welcome back. This is Maths 3000. Today I'm going to show you how to work out the next two terms of a geometric sequence. So a geometric sequence is a sequence where you multiply the previous term by a number to give you the next number in the sequence. So this number we're looking for is called the common ratio. And you can get this by dividing the second term of the sequence by the first term or the third term by the second term. So let's have a look at the first example then. So we've got the sequence 5, 20 and 80. So what I'm going to do is divide the second term by the first term. So 20 divided by 5 is 4. So the common ratio of our sequence is 4. Okay. So the term to term rule is to multiply by 4. So we can now use this to work out the next two terms in our sequence. So the fourth term in our sequence will be 80 times 4. So 8 fours of 32 and then add the 0. So our fourth term is 320. And then our fifth term then, we just need to now multiply the 320 again by 4. So 32 times 4 is 128, and then add the 0 on. So our fifth term is 1,280. So let's move on to example 2. So this time we've got 880. Eight, so it's a decrease in geometric sequence. So again, if we work out our common ratio by dividing the second term by the first term. So you could work this out in your calculator, or you could just simplify the fraction. So if we divide by 10, we get 8 over 80, and then divide by 8, we get 1 tenth. So our common ratio is one tenth. So if we multiply by a tenth, that will give us the next number in the sequence. So eight times a tenth is 0 0.8. That's our next number. And our fifth number, we just need to now multiply that by a tenth again. So that will give us 0 0.08, and that's our fifth term. Make sure you like and subscribe. Thanks for watching, guys. Bye-bye.